students. We choose to involve an eco-friendly project vermic composting. This process recycles organic waste into compost and produces valuable nutrition for school garden. Objective of the project to prepare vermic compost using earthworms and other biodegradable waste as a class project. What is vermic composting? Vermic composting is the scientific method of making compost by using earthworms. They are commonly found living in soil, feeding on biomass and excreting it in a digest form. Vermiculture means worm forming. Earthworms feed on the organic waste material and give out excreta in the form of vermic cats that are rich in nitrates and minerals such as phosphorus, magnesium, calcium and potassium. These are used as fertilizers and enhance soil quality. Vermic composting comprises two methods. First one, bed method. Second one, pit method. Process of vermic composting by bed method. Principle, compost is a natural fertilizer that allows an easy flow of water to the growing plants. The earthworms are mainly used in the process as they eat the organic matter and produce castings through the digestive system. The nutrition profiles of vermic compost are nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium, calcium, magnesium, iron, zinc. Materials required to prepare more nutrition rich compost, we will require the following ingredients. Water, compost, tool, shell, banana peels, neem leaves, vegetable scraps, cow dung. Procedure. We follow smell free and easy to implement procedure. Pitch should be in the place wherever is no direct sunlight and snow. Prepare cow dung slurry and sprinkle it on the heat for quick decomposition. Add a layer 2 or 3 inch of soil or sand at the bottom of the bed. Layer the bottom with the garden soil and then compost to start the pile. Now prepare fine bedding by adding cow dung, dried leaves, seashells and other biodegradable waste collected from fields and kitchen. Distribute them evenly on the sand layer. Add cow dung, leaves, newspaper, husk, husk. Repeat the process and multiple layers of kitchen waste, neem leaves, compost oil respectively. Continue adding both the bio waste and cow dung layer twice into the bed up to a depth of 0.5 feet. After adding all the bio waste, release the earthworm pieces over the mixture and cover the compost mixture with dry stuff. Why does earthworm add to the soil bed? Under the condition of favorable Temperature and moisture, the earthworm consume the organic matters and convert them into compost. Which types of earthworms are used in vermic composting? The most commonly used earthworm in vermic composting is Isina fetida. Why do earthworms are used in vermic composting? This species of breadworms are non burrowing. They stay on the layer of the soil and break down the waste efficiently. Garden soil keeps the bad smell and it will fasten the composting process. Whenever compost pile starts to dry up, add more water on it. Mix and Close move the top layer in frequently. Make sure the mixture is moist and do not pour water in the bed. Frequently sprinkle the water to keep the bed moist. Turn the compost and arrange the pile. Results it usually take two or three months for the compost to be made. Depending upon the weather condition. Advantages of vermic composting. The major benefits of vermic composting are develop root of the plant. Improves, improves the physical structure of the soil. Vermic composting increases the fertility and water residence of the soil. Helps in germination, plant growth and crop yield. Nutrients are nutrient soil with plant growth hormones. 
Our school received Green School Award and Certificate from Center for Environment, a NGO from New Delhi. After participated on environment audit in the natural resource within school campus. Thank you.